Hey guys, welcome back to podcast nine and three quarters. I'm your host, the Half-Blood Princess. In this video, I'm going to talk about how Caraticus Burke's memory of Merope Gaunt selling Slytherin's locket was left out of the Harry Potter movies. But before I get started, if you love Harry Potter as much as I do, be sure to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up. In Harry Potter and the Half-Blood Prince, Dumbledore and Harry begin private lessons together. In the movie, Dumbledore wants Harry to see the first moments he met Lord Voldemort as a child and reveal that even in school, Voldemort had been searching for a solution to mortality in the Horcruxes. One memory that was shown to Harry was that of Caraticus Burke, the owner of the wizarding shop Borgen and Burks, where Voldemort worked before Harry Potter. Mr. Burke described a young patron in his shop who had been none other than Merope Riddle, Voldemort's mother. She entered the shop pregnant and was ready to have the baby any day. Dressed in rags and covered in dirt, she sold to Burke the only thing of value that she owned, Slytherin's locket. After watching the memory in Half-Blood Prince, Dumbledore explained that Merope had used a love potion to trick Riddle into marrying her. She had hoped that, after so long, her husband would have fallen in love with her, so she stopped administering the love potion. She was wrong, it would seem, since Riddle left her immediately. Homeless and alone, Merope sold Slytherin's locket in the Harry Potter books, unaware that it was virtually priceless. Shortly after, she went to a London orphanage where she gave birth to her son and died. She made no effort to use magic to save her own life. Mirop was so devastated to have been left by her husband that she entirely lost her will to live, even for her son. It would have been interesting to see these memories in the movies to better understand where Voldemort came from. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section and be sure to like and subscribe. Okay, love you. Bye.